Yeah. Okay, well, yeah, yeah, William's well, lighting the candles, setting the mood for us. Oh, he's lighting the candles. All right. So cute. Is he the landscaper? Yeah. I know, and right? cool boy. <laughs> Don't forget the attention of the person behind you. <laughs> Come here, cool boy. Let us know when you're ready, okay? Like, nod your head to start it live. Okay, yeah. Yeah. So, are we out here? Shall we? Yeah, I think so. All right. These are Bonnie's words. Down. We're just. Bonnie. Yeah, Bonnie wrote this song. I didn't know that. You didn't know that? No, I didn't. Hear Bonnie her. wrote the song. Jillian wrote the music to it. I just opened my mouth. You know what? Just tell me what Bonnie didn't do. Yeah. <laughs> That's a short list. That's a shorter list. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Are we lit? Mm -hmm. He's still working. He's working on it. <laughs> you be in the background, Dr. Okay. Dale. <laughs> can you do a little dance? <laughs> yeah, you can dance. <laughs> Not again. Alright, are we all ready? Yes. Okay? Not really, but yes. wish we had some magic that could take your tears away But we only have hope to guide us on our way We are in this together and together we'll find a way To turn what comfort we can bring into a special day Hold my hand and you know I am here As you begin your journey home Our wish is to spare you sorrow You'll never be alone You'll never be alone Sometimes I feel so helpless But I will sit and listen And support you as you fight We are in this together And together we'll find a way Turn what comfort we can bring Into a special day Hold my hand and you I am here as you begin your journey home. Our wish is to spare you sorrow. You'll never be alone. You'll never be alone. down because I don't know what I would be able to get out otherwise but um, if you don't mind give me a few minutes um, some of you may have been aware that Bonnie used to always say I'm sure the people who work with her that death is not cont contagious that was a strong thing that she used to say that death was never contagious but 
I believe that her spirit and her compassion was extremely contagious. Um, you know, it's no secret that with her dedication to her work, her published books, and now her film, that she built a legacy that turned into something that's bigger than all of us. And um, I truly believe that she knew her story was and is, cap is in capable hands of being told. Um, Bonnie was the light that brought us all together on this journey of hers. And it's up to us to stick together and see it through. And I completely believe that everybody knows that, everyone knows that she loved elephants. <laughs> Clearly, we have them <laughs> all over the place in our film. And from what I gathered is that elephants resemble, an elephant resembles beauty, strength, wisdom, compassion, and everything that Bonnie was. And of course the obvious was that she always approached her patients with compassion and that she knew it was important to address the elephant in the room. And she was right. And today this is our elephant in the room. And like she always said that it's all about the journey. And no one ever said that the journey was easy, but that we have each other to lean on, like a herd of elephants. And I keep bringing them up because I believe that there was a deeper love and meaning for elephants with Bonnie. She taught me personally that grief for a loved one lives in us forever and that it's okay to grieve for that person at different times in your life. There's nothing that says you need to stop grieving. One thing I just found out is that, like us, elephants grieve the loss of their loved ones for many years. They cry and even gather to grieve in groups. When a family, I can't even read. When a family of elephants lose one of their loved ones, the other elephants form a circle around that family and stand together, allowing each other all the time they need to grieve and mourn. They don't hurry, hurry them along or push them to abandon the lost elephant. They gently touch the family with their trunks like a silent show of unwavering support. Together we're all here to support Ellen, Anna, her daughter, the family and the friends and celebrate her life. Because I know one thing for sure is that she would want us to keep our heads up and humor at the ready. I love you, Bonnie, and I promise to always keep you in my heart. Anybody else wants to add anything? <laughs> Steve?